COVID-19 is upending the way people travel. Between masks, new screening procedures, social distancing and limited in-flight service, passengers are facing new regulations and restrictions. But could a staple of travel, the paper boarding pass, make its way out of the travel world? Well, let's take a look. <laughs> Why COVID could kill the paper boarding pass. The recent trend in passenger air service is about reducing touch points. This is why airlines are removing things like in-flight magazines and scaling back services. And for things that require personal interaction, like check-in kiosks, airline employees are taking special care to disinfect those multiple times a day. Some airports are even using UV technology. But... The paper boarding pass is a bit of a stickler. Airlines are continuing to issue them. In the US, the TSA altered its policies where passengers scan their boarding pass themselves and hold it up for visual inspection by an agent. One of the reasons that airlines are becoming more vigilant is because of asymptomatic carriers. Some people may not have any symptoms, so things like temperature checks may not be effective. Beyond this, while airports and airlines are mandating masks, gloves are a different story. This leaves boarding passes vulnerable to passing on viral illnesses. Plus, between gate agents, ticket agents, security screeners and flight attendants, paper boarding passes could pass on diseases to a scary number of people. Mobile boarding passes are on the rise. Even before the COVID-19 pandemic started, Airlines began moving away from physical boarding passes. Some low-cost carriers like Spirit Airlines have even begun charging people who arrive at the airport without a mobile boarding pass and have to get one printed. Airlines apps hold a passenger boarding pass. The apps are more convenient, use less paper and are less likely to get lost. TSA agents, for example, do not handle mobile boarding passes. Passengers are supposed to scan their devices themselves. Mobile boarding passes also reduces the need for human interaction. People can check in for their flight at home. Some apps even do this automatically for passengers. Then, if you're travelling without check-in bags, you could head straight to the security checkpoint. It would not be a radical travel change. Aside from people who save their boarding passes in scrapbooks or else frame them, there are a few distributions for scrapping paper boarding passes. Airlines already have the infrastructure in place to handle paper boarding passes. The same is true for airports. With the rise of smartphones, accessibility would not be a major problem. Although in a few instances, the lack of paper boarding passes could create headaches for some travellers removed from technology. Still, airlines could continue to offer print before you come boarding passes for those limited cases. Or else, maintaining a few self-use kiosks would not be a significant hassle. So how would you feel about this change? Feel free to drop your thoughts in the comments section below. But that is all for today. So if you're new around here, do subscribe if you like this sort of content as it helps me and the channel massively. Also, drop a thumbs up if you enjoyed and learned something today. So, until next time, keep your eyes on the skies.